Hey everybody. Okay, I have a chance to make a quick video, so I'm gonna take advantage of it. I'm making a coffee right now. I'm actually running a little late. The bell is about to ring in about, ooh, can you see that right there? Oh, if you can see it, it's gonna ring in eight minutes. So, therefore, I am running late and look at me, just so I can enjoy my walk to pick up the princess. I'm making myself a cup of coffee. I use, the pot I use is a recyclable one. So all I gotta do is just, you know, pour some of the instant ground coffee in it. And then, uh, you know, I reuse it, which essentially, you know, just makes you feel good thinking that you're not using a lot of disposable things that, that are eventually gonna be thrown away, especially plastics. We're all endowed in plastics whether we know it or not even the fish in the ocean they eat, they have microplastics within them but getting to the point of this video uh, uh, which is probably going to be amongst the title the video I'm going to title it uh, human kindness and the reason why I'm going to title that is because <clears throat> let me recollect myself real quick. Uh, everything from head to toe that I'm wearing is a gift hat neighbor i don't know his name sorry but very kind person a lot of my neighbors are ex extremely kind gift glasses this was um a present from uh you know doing a little job that i did which was just cleaning up some you know a house but these are oakley's as you can see they're the whole book uh style the t-shirt present from alejandro this is from a uh, world cup the Russia one when where Putin was sitting next to the FIBA president. These were gifted today, which inspired the video. These are Kirkland brand jeans, which I know it's a reputable brand. A uh, gift from uh, Ethel. Uh, shoes, gift, Laura. Socks, gift, Alex. And then um, everything that I have is because of the extreme kindness of other individuals. And I I'm owe them all a debt of gratitude. I'm not gonna tell this video thank you because I do that a little bit too much. And I know you guys don't like watching that because you guys rather watch uh, either something that is entertaining or something that is suspenseful or something that is whatever. And I know that my vlogs are boring and they have no scripts, they have no points. But it's okay because it's YouTube and you're allowed to put whatever you want in them. So, yeah. All right, that's it. I'm done with everybody. I'm just going to put a little bit of cream. And then I got to run over to uh, the school, which is sub about a 12-minute walk. So, I'm going to be I'm gonna be about five minutes late to pick up the princess, which I do not like doing. Thank you for watching, everyone. Have a great day. Oh, uh, in two days, third place. It's going to be um, Croatia versus Morocco. Uh, oh, this is a tough call. Mm, I want to go with Morocco. Morocco stood their ground against France. Obviously, the first five minutes after that goal, they woke up. And then they held up a very good game. Uh, it, it ended up uh, France ended up only scoring one more goal. So, very similar result. Like... Uh, Argentina versus um, Argentina versus Croatia, which I'll be honest, I got a little bit soccered out because I watched so many like between the round of 16s and um, and then the uh, the uh, no between the group stage and then the round of 16. I mean, I watched so many games that. I, I saw the quality of the teams. I saw, you know, everything. But I obviously, I'm Colombian. I want uh, Argentina to win by default. But here's the thing. Soccer is 11 versus 11, right? And um, unfortunately, they cannot depend on Messi 100%. Yeah. I want Messi to shine. I want him to do 
one of his uh one of his extraordinary plays that makes us want to wa watch the game and what gets some people just to start watching to begin with. For instance, when he recovers the ball from the other side of the field and then he single-handedly dribbles it and he handles it like, like I say, Danny Alves, when he's, uh, um, he's a midfielder, when he passes it, you know, to, to, to throw a player up to the front, it's almost as if he's using his hands. These players are so talented and it's just beautiful to watch the way they play. So when Danny, when, when Messi starts to play, let's say from the other side of the field, he, he recovers a ball or he, he gets a steal and then he takes on uh, the whole ha uh, half of the field, all the players, that's, it could be three, four, five of them moves all around them. And eventually it's just between him and the goalkeeper makes the goal. That right there, that would be a World Cup history moment, which uh, I'll probably get sued by FIFA or get the video take it down. But if that does happen, I want to record it and I want to post it because it'll probably only be a five second clip because moments like that only happens in seconds because obviously sports, sports are usually happens fast. You have to be quick. You have to have really fast reflexes. That's why athletes have to train super hard and they have to be in super great shape. Let me head out. I got to get the princess. Thanks everybody for watching. Have a great day. So you'll say, yeah, my boy. All right. I just got yelled at because I am running a little late, but I got two more gifts. AirPod Pros, Chris, and then um, a lighter from uh, Italy, Alejandro again, just like the shirt. So, again, humans are kind. We, they say we're divided, but if you feel like that is true, all you have to do is Say hi to one of your neighbors. Speak to somebody that you normally wouldn't speak to. You know, say something kind or whatever, and and just change it. You you yourself can change it, and that's it. That's why you really tell people. You know, you it all starts with you. So don't don't get caught up in the these screens telling saying that we're divided. Mm -mm. We're not divided. I got plenty of neighbors here in uh, Cooper City, in uh, Pembroke Pines, that when, uh, you know, I, I, I might say, you know, I'm in between jobs right now, and I let them know, you know, hey, I could use help or whatever. And they're, you know, the ones that can, and, uh, you know, they give with a cheerful heart. and. That right there on its own. The other day when I was talking about success, that right there, that person is a successful person. They have the ability to be kind to another person, to make their day. And uh, just look at me right now. I, you know, I feel like, I don't know, not a thousand bucks. I'm not wearing any name brand except for maybe the Oakley's and the AirPod Pros. And I'm using an iPhone 13 mini, but it doesn't matter. I'm drinking a nice hot cup of brew. These are my little cousins when they were babies and my families. I say, I believe that cup was get, also get a gift for, but for Alejandro, but I end up using it most because I'm the one that uh, drinks homebrewed coffee uh, the most out of everybody in the house. That is uh, a habit that I could change, but I choose not to. I'm going to keep drinking because uh, I do it in unison with along with another bad habit so yeah maybe i will change it anyways i'm outside i'm walking almost power walking because i know i'm gonna be late but she can wait for a few minutes i got her uh I, uh one of her favorite ice creams today uh mint chocolate chip uh i know she the other day she wanted to try cookie dough i forgot about that when i was getting her the mint chocolate chip but if I'm going to ask her, I'm going to show her the ice cream when I, sh when I get home. And I'm going to tell her that, uh, honey, I got you this flavor. Show her the box. It's unopened. And say, do you, like, do you want to keep it and, in, and, and uh, enjoy this one? Or would you like me to go to the store and change it for you? And then go from there. If she wants a different flavor, we'll get her a different flavor. Because she's the princess. 
And also, oh, the one gift I didn't mention because it was personal. Uh, my queen, she also gifted me a gift. I'm not gonna say what it was, but I'll let you guys use your imagination. All right, thank you everybody. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Um, thank you for all your donations. Thank you for um, the views. Even though my uh, content is long, it, it's just essentially a video log, meaning I'm just logging uh, uh, days, moments of space time that occur within my universe and sharing it with you guys but whatever if there's a demographic out there even if it's one one thousand of the population i should have at least a thousand subscribers right i'll find out what one one thousand of it of, well it depends i don't know how many people have people have internet access and then i don't know how many people have access to youtube because china has a lot of censorship I mean, we, all the countries do, but China has that great big firewall. Anyways, thank you for watching. Let me uh, turn this off because I got to turn this on. Love you guys. Bye.